Well, folks, I see you're all really, really interested in this receiver build I'm working on. Uh, I think I just finally settled on a schematic for this one. It's going to be a regenerative receiver. Uh, there's a couple of my subscribers there that uh, wanted that this to be a uh, regenerative. So we're going to build a regenerative receiver. Uh, I settled on a tube. Well, of course, it's a tube. What else would it be? There's a type 75 tube, vacuum tube. Oh, one, two. Hopefully it works. <laughs> I'll soon find out. Uh, I got no tube tester, so, you know, works, it works. If it don't, well, I'll come up with something else. But the schematic is going to be this particular uh, schematic. This one right here. Um... No idea how well this is going to work. It's going to work at all, but we're going to give her a try. So we got a uh, on the antenna. I'm showing the side, and if I'm going to put the antenna down here, or the antenna terminal down here, or a you know piece of aluminum here with an antenna connector on it, I either here or here, trying trying to decide. It's looking to make room for a coil here, so I try a. a, a you know, I left room here for the coil, you know, on purpose. Because you've got to obviously need a coil for this thing. Uh, yes, I know that's a 12-volt transformer. 13, 24-volt, whatever. But remember, I built a vacuum tube receiver a little while ago, a battery one. And it's only running on like 30-something volts. So, yeah, 30-something volts of the plate. So I'm going to try again with this Type 75 tube and see what happens with this one. Uh, this is old transformer having old CV base station, unit in TF-108. Uh, to get the voltage up a little bit, I'm thinking I'm going to build a little voltage doubler or voltage tripler. To see if I can get the plate voltage up a little bit. But we'll see how that goes. But, uh, so far, um, me tonight, I mount out the socket and stuck the tube in the socket <laughs> that's pretty much what i did tonight and yes i'll bring out the little frequency counter radio shack frequency counter i did have a subscriber uh said i thought i seen you a little little frequency counter there and uh, yes sir i certainly still have her it's the 22-305 rf frequency counter this one works perfect anywho that's a little update for you for tonight and uh, we'll see uh, what happens. Uh, I'm going to work on her a little bit more tonight. So we'll see how she goes. Anyway, guys, take her easy. And we'll see you in the next video. Rainless 63. We're out of here.